Hello there ladies and gentlemen, Sigil here and welcome back to another video. So we're gonna try Atrocitus with Puppet over here. Uh, cause I always wanted to try him as a damage dealer. And he's got some pretty interesting specials that I'm curious to see how they synergize with Puppet. It's gonna be Napalm Vomit, I never knew that was called that. Or the special too. I don't know which one of them is more optimal to use. I don't know if this is gonna create multiple tornadoes at the same time or it's just gonna keep the one or and reset it so we're gonna try a bunch of things we got here my boy john with the site and we got here one roman with uh, the beta club to allow me to get some negative effects to just trigger uh the uh, puppet faster i'll be right back because i'm just gonna wait a bit for the cat to get settled in okay so let's get this going and i'm not sure how good this is this is probably bad he's just level one class ascension but considering how much we're gonna spam specials is gonna make no difference i mean you would get a bit more attack with the higher level class ascension but we're just gonna steal all the attack anyway bro chill come on okay now do this and we got infinite power with his special one being so so cheap, I don't think I need Beta Club here to trigger infinite power. So this is the special one. It's gonna drop multiple of these on the ground, I guess. It's nice that it, it knocks the enemy down with it, because a lot of the um, specials that are like this don't do that. Why do I keep getting damaged, though? What? Does the special one consume some of my health when I'm doing it? Oh boy. Okay, so let's super move. And let's try the Batman Ninja Batman uh, strategy with the specialty where we just keep the enemy away and just keep spamming this. Tag out, because uh, yeah, I don't think he would have survived that. Yeah, I forgot. I think his special one has a health cost to it, actually. That's why it's so cheap. That makes sense. Well, we can't keep using that, so let's try the special too. It's basically the same thing as Batman, just Batman, but worse because we don't have uh, the lethal damage from Robin. Yeah, this is pretty garbage damage. I'm not sure if the special one would do more damage in theory, but like we obviously can't really use that much. I think uh, my boy Hellboy has one of the coolest ranged attacks in the game. But yeah, this is this is not going great as far as damage goes. It's like, why would you do this when you got Batman Ninja Batman who has the same type of gameplay? If you like this type of gameplay, he has the same things when it comes to synergizing with uh, Hazard Dot's damage. But it's just better, just does more damage. And yeah, I think their specials are kind of the same thing to an extent. It's probably when they release Pet Ninja Batman, because I'm pretty sure Trustless was in the game first. They, like, recycled the special animation to an extent. So yeah, you're welcome, it's just Pet Ninja Batman, but worse. I'm, I'm never gonna use this character again. And good thing that they introduced the new... Uh, Mass Reforge and Mass Talent reroll thing because um, I'm gonna show you the build afterwards so you can see that it actually builds. Uh, but I would have said spent previously like two hours on a build like this, and I was like, Yeah, that's great. I'm never gonna use this guy again. Oh, I spent like 10 minutes, and I'm like, Yeah, that's great. I'm still never gonna use this guy again. Yeah, this is this is bad. It's kind of on par to what I would expect let's say black adam gold black adam to do with puppet but he probably still does a bit more than this so i'm not sure i'm not sure even as a budget damage though when you don't have any characters in your account i'm not sure this is this is a good choice but yeah the build is fine like we got a lot we got a lot of attack on this man we got some lethal chance crit chance crit damage it's all good he's just not pulling the numbers man and it's fine and it's understandable because he doesn't have any way to synergize with that. And yeah, that's about it. I'm probably going to build him now as a tank for arena or league invasions or something. But that's your atrocious damage dealer experience. 
Okay, so here we have the League of Archie with Zitana, Harley with Dark Metal cards, and DPI with Sight for some passive stats. So let's get this going. I really wanted to put Zatanna because she's got some burning, because this one specifically says we would probably have him fight with Girdless Steel Supergirl, but he's like specifically, if this guy is fortified, then you cannot bypass his defense with Armor Pierce. And I'm like, okay, okay, we'll just burn him. We'll just burn him. But yeah, the defense had nothing to do with the trust. So like, he was burning the enemy, and on top of that, he also does hazard dot damage, which is not impacted by defense. Unlucky with Zatanna, didn't get any free specials there. Bro, so unlucky. Damn. Oh no, again, no free spec. Bro, what is this? No, I'm not doing. I'm not trying anymore with Zatanna for a bit. Because if I do it now, I'm gonna fall in the. I'm gonna have to stun his ass now because I don't want to get super moved on Harley. But yeah, what's gonna happen is we're gonna fall in the trap of uh, getting Puppet activated, then it expires like half a second later, trying to get it active again, again it expires half a second later. Okay, now we're getting some free specials, that's nice. Okay, we got infinite power, finally. But yeah, sometimes if it doesn't work out nicely, you're better off just waiting a bit. Because you got all the negative picks that are kind of uh, waiting to expire. And it, it's gonna mess up your gameplay more. Hit his ass in the corner. Yeah, we're absolutely destroying his ass. Okay, let's stun him, and it should be over. Yeah, probably I would have been fine without Zatanna. But let's move on to the next fight. Okay, so you have Raven. With Constantine with Twin Blades. And with Swamp Thing with uh, the passive stats, basically. And we're gonna kill Garla Steel Supergirl. Bro, the annoying lethal resistance spread all over the place and the soul rate is just getting on my nerves. Like, chill, what has... How has lethal damage hurt you so much? It's annoying because a lot of teams... I mean, even this team to an extent... I mean, no, 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 Constantine doesn't have lethal damage on Twin Blade. A lot of teams use lethal damage not as a primary source of dealing damage, but as something to add a little bit on top. And I mean, fine, you don't want me to use Bed the Ninja team here for some reason or Brainiac, but you're also hurting all of my teams a little bit, which is annoying. You get Constantine in there. I know it looks bad, but it'll get better as the fight goes on. Bro, Darkness on a 6-star Raven lasts so much longer than on a 5-star Raven. It's just uncomparable. A Swamp Thing, tank this please. Thank you very much. Probably didn't really need to tank takes one thing, but it's fine. Come on, burn her. Come on, casting. There we go. Yeah, I should not tag like that anymore, because I really risk the Raven having a special delay and ruining everything. Okay, we're really starting to deal some decent damage here.
There we go. Let's move on to the next fight. Now we here have Batman the Drowned with God Killer. Batman. Batman with the Scythe and we got my boy Robin with Puppet, so let's get this going. This man is again gonna have lethal resistance. Also gonna have uh, Special 2 disabled, which we don't really care about with this team. So let's see how this goes. Getting that infinite power going. Let's do the percentage shell damage. You, ger you generally just need three third specials. You're gonna be fine. Okay. I think Robin can get a bit too early there. I was thinking about something else and playing a bit on autopilot and looks like it mal 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 malfunctioned a bit. Boy, that's a that's a hard word to say for some reason. Uh, but yeah, let's move on to the next fight. Okay, so here I have Beast Boy. With puppets, I mean, he's generally able to one shot this easily, even with all the buffs. But we're also gonna get the huge damage increase for from the um, Batman the Drunk constant buffs. So let's get this going. We're first gonna tag out over here. Beast Boy back in. Yep, that's infinite power. We're just going to keep it going. Bro, you know what? Let's just actually spam the special two. Because I want to spend the entire fight gathering as many buffs as possible from her. And whenever we got like uh, only like let's say one minute we do super move and we try to get the 40 hit combo and see how that goes because i'm gonna kill her way before that if i don't do this yeah probably i could spam special one a bit faster but i'm not sure if that denies the super move or not Okay, we're probably gonna do it at one minute. Currently just getting the Manta dot damage. Imagine if that was all the dot damage Beast Boy was doing. That would be pretty bad. I think first I'm gonna tag out to let her do her super move. I mean, obviously I'm gonna do that. There's no way around it. Especially with Beast Boy having so many negative effects applied to himself. Like, he's gotta easily die. Okay, so first sub tag Manta. Maybe throw a special two in there. Okay, we got that sorted out. Super move is all the way. Let's do a few third specials now. To make sure we get some proper negative effects on her. I don't see not that much damage considering how many damage buffs I got. And now super move. I would have liked to do super move a bit earlier, actually, but um, 
doing that specialty with Manta actually consumed a lot of power. Like, eh, just one more negative effect to make sure we don't lose Puppet, but that costed a lot. And yeah, actually, I'm not gonna kill her. I overestimated how much the damage box would help. And it also took me a bit longer to do this. Or are we killing her? Are we actually killing her? Come on, Beast Boy. Come on, almost there, buddy. Come on. Let's go. Two seconds left. Yeah, I, I pushed it literally as far as I could. Uh, but yeah, let's take a look at the rewards we got for this one. And we got... Oh, wow. Multiverse White Canary and Amulet of Tag. That's, that's garbage. And for last fight, you have my boy Lord Joker here. With the uh, puppet equipped. We got Fate Club on my boy uh, Batman. And then Robin uh, with the uh, side equipped. So let's get this going. This guy's got the extended tag in, which is not ideal. Because, yeah, with Puppet Joker, I can stay the full duration. But with Beta Club Batman, Jet Batman, there's not that much of a point in staying that long tagged in. But it should still be fine. Uh, my bad. Got the burning, got the infinite power. And I lost infinite power. Because the beta club just expired and... Uh, yeah, I think we have to tag Batman back in. Let's do a third special because that's an additional negative effect that might be enough to help Joker up, please! Oh, we got it. We got it. The, the initial activation was always going to be the hardest part, but now that we got it going, we, we should be fine. Bro, stop blocking my... That's the biggest problem with Batman, Jeff Batman, with Puppet. His jump attacks kind of suck in, in terms of the fact that they get blocked a lot of the times. Oh, I should not have tried to reset that. We are on 70 million. I gave it away for 15 mil. That's bad. Oh, it's fine. If we got 70 mil once, we can get it again. Bro. Okay, 41 mil. I'll, I'll take that. I'll keep that. That's good enough. pushing him uh i think we win i think we still win here i think he dies to bait the club yeah there we go there we go uh that was a little bit of a close one thanks so much for watching like if you liked it dislike if you liked it and i'll see you all in the next one Goodbye.